a segment from the 7th Just RPG.com podcast. If you enjoyed this podcast, please make sure to check the video description below where you'll see a link to the full version. Enjoy. And for our next topic, we're going to be talking about Pokemon Sun and Moon, which is coming out this Friday. This week? Yep. Yeah. Wait, what date is that? The 18th? Yep. The 18th. Yep. The 18th. <laughs> um, all right, so which one did you... Did you order it already? I didn't. I'm going to pre-order it on Amazon when I get home. <laughs> I did on Amazon. I did one day shipping. Um, so I don't have Prime. I, I picked Sun. Do you have a preference? No, I also picked Sun because yeah. it has... Um, what's that puppy Pokemon? I don't know Rock the names of something. I don't, I don't know their names yet, but... Uh, I, saw, I like the Legendary a lot better. It's really cool. It's like a lion. Yeah, it's a really cool lion. And uh, I was reading that, like the time of day, depending yes. on what game you get, is extended for, you know, whatever game you have. It's also reversed, depending on which version you have. Mm -hmm. So if you get moon, then your daytime is nighttime in game. Yeah. And oh yeah, that's actually pretty good for me. <laughs> yep. Well, I mean, even though I have Sun, I'll probably end up playing at night time, which will actually be night time. But, <laughs> <laughs> but uh, I mean, just from the Legendary alone in the box art, I, I depict it. Mm -hmm. um, I also saw the Ultra Beasts are specific to each oh, version. Oh, yeah. I forget which one I saw, but I like the ones in Sun a lot better. And you get Alola Vulpix in yeah. Sun, which is, I mean, I I'm, like Sandshrew. I don't think, I mean, for... For me, it doesn't really matter. I'm probably going to get both. Mm -hmm. I'm probably going to oh, get yeah. Moon eventually. Probably pretty soon. So I mean, I'll get access to all the Pokemon. I have friends getting Moon anyway, so I'm not too worried about that. But. Yeah, I actually have a lot more friends getting Moon than oh, getting good. Sun, which is weird because usually it's red and blue and, I don't know, the other ones. And everyone picks, like, the very first one. Yeah, everyone picks the one that's closer to, to red. Yep. <laughs> So, you know, X and Y. Most people, I think, picked X. Yeah. So whatever. Because they didn't like the Y Charizard version. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah I thought he was it. cool. Yeah, I liked both of them. But, uh, yeah, they were all good. Yeah, I mean, I just I just like the box art. I think that's really... <laughs> and I'm, Which one am I going to play through and experience first? I'd rather do the daytime. Yeah. One, personally. You know, I'm going to play both. I'm going to experience both. But, you know... Um, what do you think of the setting this time? It's basically Hawaii. It's awesome. I love I beach themes. Idea. I it's... like that they they started with X, so they picked France and mm -hmm. Paris, you know, which I think is a good idea based on a real place. Japanese love Paris. Yeah, and I guess they like Hawaii too. You know, like, oh yeah, well, that's I mean, where they vacation. I guess they don't like it enough to not bomb it. But. <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> but, uh, why? <laughs> but yeah, I mean. I, I like that realistic setting. Um, I, and, yeah, I think this is going to be a trend, obviously, after they did X and Y, now they're doing this one. I think I think that's a new trend, which is cool. Mm. Very cool. I'm super excited. Um, I love all the beach areas in Pokemon. They were my favorites. And I like all the beach Pokemon and water Pokemon. Yeah, I wonder if there's just more water Pokemon available than usual. Um, That'd be awesome. I wonder how quickly you get... Well, there are no... I think they removed the HMs, and now you're just yes. using Pokemon to ride. Mm -hmm. um, so I wonder how quickly you get access to the air and how quickly you get access to the water. Um, that usually like sets the tone, I think, for the game. If you get like fly early or surf early, it like opens up yeah. more quickly. So I wonder if they're gonna hold out or you know. I hated having to wait like half the game to get fly, which yeah, was especially in the originals. It yeah. was kind of a pain in the butt to get surf and fly or late game, and you get like ones like flash that you don't care about. I hated know? getting flash. I, I I just made it through that cave without flash. The first one. Oh my god, me too. Yep. Yeah, I never... I just walked around aimlessly until mm -hmm. I found my way. <laughs> I didn't even know that you could get Flash. Like, when I first played as a child, I was like, I had no idea. So I just... I was like, this is it. This is how I die. Well, they've added, they've added move deleters since, so it's not yeah. a big deal. But I remember my first playthrough, my Charizard has Flash, Strike, <laughs> Fly, you know. What a Cut. waste. Yeah, complete waste. But, yeah, now I know better. Mm-hmm. 
Um, what feature are you looking forward to the most? This one. Oh god. Um, the Alola versions, I guess. That's a big one. I haven't seen any new Megas, have you? No, I haven't. I know they're still in the game, but... Um, I think the Z-moves look interesting from a yeah. competitive standpoint. Oh, okay. Yeah, this is like the game that I know the least about. Like the... Yeah, I've, I, I haven't looked at the leaks. Mm -hmm. I've seen trailers, but I, I, I try not to look at the leaks. I only see things... Like, I only see like the really funny Alola uh, versions, yeah. like the trio... Which I definitely 100% want because yeah, of that hair. Ridiculous. <laughs> and uh, that's a good thing. Oh, <laughs> uh, what else? Um, what were some of the other features? Well, new Pokemon, a yeah. lot on forms. I actually didn't really like. A lot of the Pokemon didn't really stick out to me that much this time around. I liked uh, the Type Null. Looks very interesting. Which one's that? It's, its name is Type Null. Um, it's hard to kind of describe, but I think it's one of the more, like, serious-looking ones. Um, I just like cute, and I also like dragon. So well, I think that Jangmo-O? Jangmo-O. Jangmo-O, something like that, right? That one looks like it's going to be dragon. I think they already said it was. Is that the one that has, like, two different types, and one is, like, beauty, and the other is, like, strength or something like that? That I don't recall. No. Um, I mean, the new Pokemon look cool, but I think the Z-moves are going to add another strategy element. It's kind of like a Mega Stone that gives you a super move to use. Yeah. I wonder how that's going to play out competitively. I wonder if that's going to work. I also saw they did stat changes on a lot of Pokemon. They've nerfed and they buffed quite a few. Really? Like who? Well, um, oh, there was one big one, uh, Bear Tick, oh. which kind of was ignored mm -hmm. before. Now got like an a significant attack boost. So it looks like it's going to be usable competitively, which is good. Um, I think the trio, like the ones that they gave some new attention to mm -hmm. with the long forms, I think they they buffed a little bit. Which, I mean, okay. is good, otherwise you would care if they gave them new forms. Yeah. But I'm sure you've seen the memes with Executor and... Oh, yeah. And, um, Meowth and Persian. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> sassy Meowth. I mean, extra sassy. Oh, I mean, I like the 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 mustache Radatha. Oh, my God. Radicate. Those That's look cool. So oh, and of course, looking. uh, what's that one? The gumshoes? The... The one that looks like Donald Trump. Oh my God! <laughs> that was I, I'm, such def a... I'm definitely gonna try to use that. Why? <laughs> it looks hilarious. I'm just gonna throw it away. <laughs> uh, what is your starter going to be? Ooh. You know, I usually go fire. Um, I might go grass this time. I like the grass ghost combo on the final stage. Yeah. The raw whatever. I don't know the, the the third stage name, but I usually don't go grass. And I think I might this time. I mean, I'm going to get all three, but I get a first playthrough. Um, or I'll just go back to... I'm definitely not picking Warner. That's right. I don't want any circus freak. Hey, don't talk about her like that. <laughs> she yeah, is a gem. I am not, I'm not into that one. I like it. I like the seal, but I always go grass. Really? Yes. I usually go fire. Cause I, I, mean, I, I usually go fire because of fighting, fighting fire. Types. Oh. Oh, and this one is fighting fire. Is Wait, it? is it? It's like dark and also. I thought it was like dark fire, so I thought it was different. Incineroar. Fire dark. Yeah. Which kind of makes it less appealing for me. I thought it was kind of weird. People are sick of firefighting, but I, I love it. <laughs> I love Infer I loved Infernape. I hated that. I loved Pokemon. Infernape and I love Blaziken. Blaziken's one of my favorites. Especially to use competitively. Awesome. Speed boost. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> well, Beautiful. Yeah, I'm definitely going to get Rowlet. And, I mean... Yeah, I think I I'm heard into it now. Competitively, it has the best base stats and oh, growth it? stats. I just like the typing. It's an interesting type. I like ghost types, and grass ghosts is an interesting type. Are there any other grass ghosts? Not that I know of. I mean, I'm, there might be... There's always, like, something you don't remember. But. Yeah. Probably something from, like, black and white. I don't think so, though. No? 
but yeah, I think it's going to be a fun type to use. I, Ghost is interesting to use, so I'm coming to that. Um, I mean, there are the goofy new Pokemon too, of course. Cosmog. Yeah. This thing looks cute. I want it. <laughs> but I mean, overall, I do like the new designs. That one, it's like a bear. It looks like a pedo bear. Yeah. Pink one. Yeah, what's, it, what's that one's name? This one. Boo. Beware. Beware. No! <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm not so into that one, but I mean, it's a decent design. Oh it looks like a pedal bear, though. God, why? <laughs> that thing looks ridiculous. Um, I like the, the fake Pikachu. Mimikyu. Oh, Mimikyu. Yeah, that's also a great idea. Cute. Ghost <clears throat> fairy. Yeah, that's going to be interesting, too, to play. There's a lot of these bird Pokemon, but I think they're all the same. Yes, they are. Oric, Oh, there's also the, the the school form of that fish. Oh. Um, Which is also interesting. Interesting new way to go about it. Mm-hmm. I'm just... I don't like the new monkey Pokemon. I never liked Which monkey Pokemon. There's this one that looks like Oranguru. Oh, eh, it looks okay, but not not too into. It. I mean, it's all. What, re what really matters in the end for me is how viable are they mm -hmm. to actually use in competitive play. Because mm -hmm. I mean, I'll breed every new one that is competitive. I will try, or one of my friends will, you know. Yeah. <gasps> Ooh. <laughs> Dragon ground. Yeah. This one. Zygarde? Zygarde. That's a... Zygarde. Uh, Zygarde was a legendary in um, X and Y that they expanded on in the anime. Uh -huh. And now they're having you collect basically pieces of it. Ooh. And it's different percents of different forms. Which is also an interesting way to do another legendary. That's really cool. I mean, yeah, I mean, I guess we could wrap it. But overall, I think... Oh, yeah. I think that they're doing a lot of cool, innovative stuff mm -hmm. with this new one. It looks promising. It looks like they're moving in the right direction. They're, they're not, it doesn't look like it's going to be stale. I don't get that impression. No, because, I mean, they introduced so many new features to this. But my my real question in the end of, at the end of the day is um, how easy is the story going to be? How engaging is it? And then what does competitive look like? when it's all said and done. That's really what I care about. Yeah, I'm just about the cute Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> there will be plenty of those. So. Yeah! <laughs>